Yo, what's up guys? It's me Shadow and today we're going to be going over how to make some ambient sample type destroy lonely beats. Before we get in this video, I just want to say guys, I'll leave a link down below to my Patreon if you guys want access to all of my tutorial video FLPs as well as some other bonus perks. You guys can check it out in the link down below. It's only $3 a month for the FLP tier. I think that's kind of a steal. So yeah, if you guys want to go check that out, link down below. Lastly guys, all of the kits that I'm going to be using in this video are on my brand new website, shadowstore.co. That is .co, not .com. And yeah, yeah, without further ado guys let's just hop right into this video all right guys so these are the one shots that we're going to be using for this video These one shots guys are from my gateway sound kit. I'm gonna leave a link down below to purchase that. I also have free demos for all my kits. So if you guys just wanna try things out for free, like I said, all of my kits have free demos, link down below. So yeah guys, those are the one shots, pretty simple here. And then these are the drums that we're gonna be using. All of these drums are from my haunted sound kit and yeah the last thing i'm gonna go over guys is that we're gonna set the bpm to 130 for this beat you know just like a pretty standard bpm literally fl studio opens with this bpm and yeah that's all i gotta say so guys the first thing i'm gonna do in this beat is just lay out some super simple chords we're gonna be using a specific plugin to really carry um the melodies and i will show you guys once i have like a good chord progression laid out All right, so there you guys go. This is like a pretty uh, not great <laughs> chord progression, I guess. It's like very simple. We're just using like, I, I don't even know what the right term is, but I spaced all the notes apart, uh, seven semitones or six little gaps in the piano roll. And then once I had a good chord progression, I basically pasted it over again and raised it up an octave. You know, we just have some more layers covered. Now guys, we're gonna go over to the mixer track and we are going to open Shaper Box 3. Uh, obviously you guys can use Shaper Box 2 or any shaper box but um this is really what we're going to be using to carry all of our melodies in this video i'm going to use this double up preset guys and this preset is from my shifter sound kit there are 80 shaper box three presets in this kit if you guys want presets for like destroy lonely dom corleo yeet sgb west like i can't even categorize this because it's really like so multi-purposed um but it really works super well for these kinds of beats because after we apply this preset it's going to sound like this Then guys, just to make it sound more sample-y, um, I'm going to cut out all the low end and then I'm going to add a second EQ where I'm going to cut out some high end and then even more low end, even though we probably don't have it. And uh, now it is going to sound like this. You guys can already hear the vibe that we are going for. It is really uh, sounding destroy lonely eyes, very opium. I don't know what to call it, but you guys, okay. You guys get the point. I'm just gonna stop talking uh, and just kind of move on with the beat. I'm gonna copy the original melody that we have, guys. I'm actually gonna paste it into the same uh, preset. I'm gonna raise it up an octave and then load it into another Shaper Box preset. This preset right here, okay, stop playing. This preset right here, Crowd War, sounds super fire to me, so that's what I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna make both of the melodies stereo, guys. I'm gonna lower the Crowd Roar and I'm going to uh, EQ out a lot of the low end because again, this is a melody and this is an accent, so I want it to be even quieter like this. Another layer that we have going on in this melody. This sounds kind of weird on its own right now. Again though guys, Shaperbox 3. I'm just spamming Shaperbox on this beat because it sounds really good. Now guys, I think I'm just gonna add like one more sound and then we're done with the melody. We're gonna do drums and then wrap this video up.
I wonder what VST effect plugin I might use on this. You guessed it. It's Meow Synth. Nah, um, yeah, Shaperbox, Shaperbox again. Um, I want this to be like a, like a kind of a background noise. So I'm gonna use this Starship preset. I really like this one. It's very like wonky. But now guys, we have everything together. So if we play it all at once, it's gonna sound like this. Alright guys, now that the melody is out of the way, we're going to go on to drums, which is super easy. I'm just going to lay out a, a clap pattern really quick, which I like to do just 8-step. Delete, you know, the ones you don't need, and then you have a super simple 8-step. And then I'm going to lay out a 2-step hi-hat, which I'm going to make minor changes to. But for the most part, the drums aren't going to be too crazy in this video. Yeah, honestly, bro, my posture is so bad. Look at this. This this is how I be making beats like this. Uh, no, guys, but really, this that's it. You know, we're gonna do the 808, and then the the drums are over. Especially being inspired by Lone's most recent project. Uh, it's really like more melody focused. I feel like you know, obviously, you can go crazy with whatever you want. Just because of the fact that I'm inspired by that specific project, I'm not gonna go too crazy with like you know rolls and snares and blah blah blah. This is all we got. Back to making my beats. <laughs> But yeah, guys, I'm actually going to leave the video here. If you guys want to know how I structure my beats, I'm going to leave a link on one of the sides of the screen um, to my structuring tutorial video. If you guys watch this video all the way through, thank you so much. I really do appreciate you guys who watch my videos all the way through. If you guys like this video, leave a like. If you didn't, don't. Remember to hit the subscribe button, guys. I post videos three times a week on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday covering underground and upcoming artists, challenge videos, entertainment content, and more. Yeah, guys, I hope you enjoy this video. Have a good day or night. Peace.